Okay, so I'm hoping this <clears throat> does not look too bad, but I'm using my husband's laptop with the webcam because my phone keeps cutting out in videos. So I'm doing my 31 week update despite the fact that I turned 32 weeks Thursday um, um, because there was so much to catch up on and I did not get around to my 31 week update. So it's only like a couple days into my 32 weeks. I can't really talk much about 32 weeks. So yeah. Um, I actually lost my mucus plug like two or so weeks ago and did not realize it because I didn't know what it was, but yeah, I lost that. Um, I think I've been having Braxton Hicks or what appears to be Braxton Hicks. It's not too bad though. So, um, but I'm not really worried. I don't feel like I'm going to go into labor soon and I, I hope I don't. I'm not really worried, worried. She's been moving a ton and, um, um, yeah, so I think she's going to wait it out until the C-section date. I hope. We don't want to push her any farther than she needs to be, so. And since I'm only 32 weeks now, um, yeah, I don't really want to go into labor anytime soon. My hospital is around an hour and 45 minutes away or so. It's in another state, which, you know, that's where I will feel comfortable going. I've had a lot of back pain. I've had a lot of um, feet pain and some swelling in my hands. A little bit of feet swelling. I feel huge, which um, that's normal <laughs> because I'm getting huge. So I mean, she's growing and I'm glad. Uh, we have got more baby stuff. And I can't wait to do a baby haul of baby stuff. Um, we have a diaper bag still to get. We have the car seat and the cribbing, which is the three main things. And more cloth diapers, which is probably the most stuff last time. And we're still slacking, but we've got other stuff. So we're going to get there. Uh, let's see. Um... I turned 32 weeks Thursday, but not a lot's gone on since then, so I'm going my 31 week, and that's what I'm talking about now. Uh, let's see, what all else has gone on? Oh, the mucus plug being gone, which I think I lost at my 30, 30th or 29th week. I didn't know what a mucus plug actually looked like, even though I lost it with Kamaya and that was around 28 weeks. But that was because of the car wreck and everything else and a lot of things went on that time. So I didn't realize I lost it, just what I know what my husband told me because of the doctors and all that. So I was in hospital uh, during that time. And I was on a lot of pain medications and stuff. So that's why I don't know a lot about that. Um, but by 31 weeks, I have had a lot of swelling my feet, a lot of swelling my hands, well not a lot, but when I did I cook my ring off it was so swollen. A lot of back pain, terrible back pain. I've had what appears to be Braxton Hicks. Um, I've had a lot of movement with her, so much you can see like the little pushing, you can see how much it pushes up. So I'm pretty sure that was a foot, but you can see it like, you could feel it, it was like a bump. I wish we got a picture, but my phone's, it died so much, so. Um. That is all I can think about. Uh, tailbone pain. Um, that's about it, I think, that I remember right now. I may remember more next week or whatever, but I'm trying to get caught up on videos. And so I want to mention about the whole mucus plug, losing that and Braxton Hicks, but I don't appear to have anything really serious going on right now, so I'm good. I don't have a doctor's appointment until like two to three weeks, three weeks maybe. I don't know, 
think it's like three weeks away. But I don't, I don't, maybe it's two weeks away. I don't know. And then I let him know everything. But he goes on vacation next week. Or the week I don't know. He'll be on vacation. That's why I couldn't go earlier. But I don't think it's anything to worry about, in my opinion, because I just don't feel like she's coming anytime soon. And I'm hoping she don't. So I'm going to show you my belly picture, or belly photo of me. I'm going to show you my belly. So, here goes nothing, or everything, whatever. I'm getting pretty huge. I've got two chest marks, which were really, 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 really um, dark. But the cocoa butter that I put on my belly, or my husband puts on my belly, every night has got them down a lot less than what they were. I'm sorry I keep looking around everywhere, so I'm not used to the one place I'm looking at. Like, I think I should look at the screen like this, and then I realize, oh, the camera's up there. So, sorry. Okay, uh, let me show you my belly. Here it is. There we go. And there it is here. I don't know if you can see the stretch marks or not, but they're like right over here. Um, yeah. So, there it is here. See how round I'm getting in plump? Not sure how much weight I've put on so far. Stress marks are right there. And I don't know if it's visible or not, so. Um. Yeah. There is my belly at officially 32 weeks. I've got a 31 week uh, picture on my Instagram, which is currently private, so you can ask to follow up if you want. Uh, and it'll probably be on private eventually soon, but I don't know. Okay, and my Instagram is just look at Roxy Princess with a Z. Princess and not sis. So thank you for watching and subscribe if you're not subscribed. And I hope you like my video even though I'm all over the place. And yeah, that's it. Thank you for watching and have a great night or day or whatever it is where you're at. It's night here. So okay. That's all. Thank you for watching.